Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 4th. You know, the timing is fluid. I was going to do Capricorn next, but I backed out at the last minute and decided to do this instead. So, let's just see what comes up for the daily. Sorry about that, Capricorn. So what do we have for let's see, around the fourth? Knight of Pentacles. So Knight of Pentacles, a hard worker, somebody that is grounded, very practical, very realistic, typically doesn't give up, okay? This person doesn't give up. They want something. They go for it. They take their time to get it. This is a very hard worker. Um, <sighs> very responsible. So it looks like this guy has, this. maybe there's a test here. I consider this one of my test cards. The Knight of Pentacles, slow and steady wins the race, right? So hard work, hard work. Two of Wands reverse. Now these are both um, about playing it safe. When you get it both, I mean, they're both about safety. So somebody is trying to play it safe, trying to be practical. Um, could be dealing with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, trying to be practical, deciding not to go. Interesting. That is deciding not to go. Uh, you know, a delay, staying put, wanting to play it safe. So somebody is wanting to play it safe. They're deciding, you know, not to go somewhere for some reason. There's there's some sort of fear with the two of wands reversed. Fear of the unknown. So the plans have been canceled. So there could be some disappointment here with the two of wands reversed. But this is about patience. The knight of pentacles is very patient. But the two of wands reversed could be... You know, there could be a sudden arrival or a sudden return. Somebody could be coming in with a, you know, opportunity. It's a real opportunity. This is somebody that is very uh, genuine, okay? Has a lot of integrity. This person doesn't typically move fast, really plans before they take action. It's a planner. So somebody, and this looks like he has, a, he has something in his hand which is a solid, it's a solid offer. So somebody is offering something to somebody <clears throat> or they have something solid to offer, but there's a delay, definitely a delay or a pushback. You know, I'm not ready. Not a good time. This is choosing to be safe, deciding, being held back. Somebody is being held back. Maybe they're being held back by... Um, some sort of restrictions or wanting to be safe, you know, very safe. Let's keep it safe. I got to, I got to remain safe. Um, Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands is, uh, well, this is, this is somebody that has a lot of confidence, a lot of, uh, attraction as well. It looks like we have somebody here that is very attracted to this Queen of Wands, could be a male or a female doesn't I don't feel like this has to be either or this person is vibrating very very highly probably very focused on their health health oriented very determined you know um, determined to be strong now this is about strength I feel like we have somebody here that is focusing on their health. <clears throat> Maybe that's why they're deciding not to go somewhere. They're focusing on their health, you know, wanting to protect themselves. Queen of Wands upright. Very, very um, strong, determined, proud, optimistic. It's 
about protection because she's very protective. You know, wanting to... I think we have somebody here who wants to protect their health. You know? Working on their health. Huh. Emperor. Now the Emperor takes charge. This is about organization. Uh... Planning something. Somebody is planning something. Planning to take control. Now the emperor is a boss, a leader, a ruler that is given to take action. And we definitely have some action here. Somebody is taking action. This is like an anti-climax, though. The Two of Wands reversed. It's, it's like, you know, something not happening. Somebody is stuck. They can't go. They can't go. Um, they want to go. They do want to go, but they can't go because they're restricted. But anyway, this emperor, this emperor is a masculine energy that maybe may seem very distant you know that is ready for battle that has a tough exterior <clears throat> i don't know what is going on with my voice there's difficulty in communication by the looks of things um this is a fighter of some sort so this is i feel i'm there this is a ruler making a decision so somebody is making a decision that is you know, best for them, best for the community. We have a very strong, uh, I feel like we have a very strong masculine energy that is planning something because we have planning a couple different times. This is planning and this is planning. They're planning something. There may have been some sort of delay or something like that. Um, but this is about taking charge it's about structure and order. I don't know. Maybe it's, I mean, this person isn't in a position of authority. I don't know. Maybe it's doctor's orders or government orders or, or something like that. There's some sort of order here. There's an order in place. Somebody maybe may have canceled some plans because of, you know, need to protect because there's a lot of protection here a need to protect maybe it's need to protect themselves hmm. let me just bring that up a little bit and I'll bring it up and then I'm going to bring it down there we go We definitely have a fighter here. We definitely have a fighter. We have a warrior. We have a very noble individual that is, is, uh, well, this is a winner. This is a winner. Uh, somebody, the battle is over. This is a position in a position of authority that is winning a battle. They are not going to give up. They're not going to give up. So that's interesting. Um, this is victory. This is making progress. This is, uh, we have somebody here that has a lot of life experience as well. It's all, they have a lot of confidence. I feel like we have a, a very highly um, optimistic, confident, uh, strong, wise individual here that is uh, winning some sort of battle. This is winning a battle. It is. This is a win. This is a yes, and there's public recognition here, or recognizing something. It's like the battle is over, the fight is over. Uh, but that right there, um, two of wands reversed. That is a that's 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 the problem. Okay, that's the problem here in this reading because that's indecisiveness, restrictions, and that's lack of planning. So there's there's there could be some unplanned entrance you know because that's an entrance arrival there could a sudden arrival of some sort 
there is a sudden arrival of some sort. I think we have somebody here that has been planning. They've been planning to uh, show up or something like that. Um, this Queen of Wands, that's somebody that is very, very attractive in a position of power as well. So this is a powerful individual who... Um, Somebody is very attracted to this individual, put it that way, and they're coming with a solid offer. And and maybe it's that they're just attracted to, to this person's vibration, you know, this person's charisma. There's some sort of charisma here. Um, hmm. High Priestess. High Priestess is receptive, reflective, keeps to themselves waiting for the moment taking it all in very very sexy energy we definitely have somebody here that is very has a lot of uh no you know sex appeal by the looks of things somebody is very because this is very seriously um and we have a this is a very masculine energy that is uh getting ready to fight for somebody or getting ready to um, show up what the hell is going on I mean that six of wands is making progress victory after a battle this is somebody that is a fighter that never gives up so there is going to be a victory for this individual who did not give up now this is um, the high priestess knows maybe there's been some sort of intuition that has said that this person was going to win or this person was going to show up or this person was going to be in a position of authority or something like that. This is a, a tarot reader, a healer, um, a psychic, a medium. She has some sort of information that she has been keeping to herself she or he, this person has been keeping it to themselves about um, a person. It's like you know, you know something. Now, I wonder, because that Two of Wands is getting me. That Two of Wands reverse. It's like there's some, some sort of uh, canceled or delayed plans. It's canceled or delayed travel or canceled or delayed... Um, movement you know there's a restriction here this queen of wands can be forceful somebody may be trying to force their way force something to happen mm -hmm. this is a decision maker somebody is making a decision and they could be and it's interesting this just came you got two here we could have two separate people we definitely there's a decision between two people here there is so somebody is making a decision between two avenues, between two paths. They've been indecisive. They've been procrastinating. They've been waiting. They've been, they have been planning. They know they need to make a logical, practical, responsible decision. Anyhow, Knight of Swords. Now the Knight of Swords is, is fast, moving very, very, very fast. There's a, going to be a sudden arrival or a sudden departure. There's no doubt about it. We have somebody here that is going to assert themselves. They're going to communicate. They're going to speak up. Interesting that I had a hard time a minute ago. They may have been having a hard time communicating. They're about to communicate. Um, I feel like there's there could be a battle as well. There could be some sort of, because of that Six of Wands, next to that Knight of Swords, we could have a fight. We could have a fight over leadership, which we are we, we probably will. Okay, um, so yeah, a fight for the top position. So I feel like we have an individual here that um, may have two options. Somebody is going to be coming in to fight. They're going to be fighting. It's a fight for the position. <laughs> By the looks of things, um, we have somebody here that is very focused, they're authoritative, they're decisive, um, educated, and then they may be, I, I don't know if they're angry as well, there could be some angry or anger with the Knight of Swords. Uh, it feels like we have, we have a very strong, strong, strong individual here that is taking charge. They're taking charge, they're, they're coming in really fast. 
um, but they're coming in with something solid as well. So they they've they've got some sort of the epiphany, or they've got some sort of idea that they want to run with, and they're going to run with it. Okay. Um, now this high priestess is somebody that takes time to reflect that sensed this was coming. Feels like there is there is a very strong strong uh, leader that is uh, absolutely going to be winning some sort of battle. Okay, that's the strong leader leader, and this is a winner. This is somebody m making a getaway as well. We could have somebody that is leaving very quickly. Um, I feel like we have we have one person here that is hiding something. It could be it could be this the Queen of Wands, you know, this per because of that the High Priestess. Somebody is hiding something. They're hiding something, and I feel like whatever it is, at the, but that they're hiding. I feel like there's going to be something that is said that reveals it with that Knight of Swords. That's that's. Uh, some sort of reveal. We do have a champion here. This is a champion. So I think that there is a champion that is, this This is a champion. And I feel like the champion is, you know, it could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Just saying. That's what this is. So, um, that's the winner. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, I'm just going by what the cards say. Anyhow, I feel like this is, the Queen of Wands is uh, can get upset, can throw tantrums. So I'm wondering if somebody may throw a tantrum, may try to stop something from happening. I don't know. Um, I know I've changed the story quite a bit. That Queen of Wands is this is also can also be very excited. You know, this is a time of growth. It's a time of fertility. You know. So I feel like there is a, there is a new beginning here with that Queen of Wands. It's a new beginning. Um, it's very very exciting. Um, somebody may be put in the spotlight as well. I think that Ooh, two eights right next to each other. One reversed, one upright. Now an obstacle is being removed. Somebody's leaving. Somebody is walking away. They will be conceding, which we know that they will. So somebody is leaving. Maybe it's the other woman. If this is a love relationship situation, the Queen of Wands represents another woman. And I do see two choices here. Or the other opponent. Okay? So there, the other opponent is going to be leaving. Okay, an obstacle is being removed. They've somebody has been trapped in a situation. They've been trapped. They've been stuck. They've been uh, confined. But now this person is leaving, and there, there's somebody is able to uh, follow through with their plans. They may have been restricted. They've been somebody was restricted. They were restricted from taking action, but I think they were planning to. And now, now they can. This obstacle is being removed. Um, somebody has their eye on a very spiritual individual. This person is a healer of some sort with that high priestess. That's a healer, a tarot reader, medium, psychic, empath, whatever. Um, and here they come. And here they're coming. They're coming fast, okay? And they want to be on top. They want to be in the top position. Um... They want the victory. And I feel like this person has been urged to do so. But they had to be solid. They may have had to get ready. They may have had to wait for the moment. You know, they may have had to get all their ducks in a row before they could step forward. Um, the obstacle that is being removed is this person that was forceful. Because they're marrying each other. So we have a very forceful individual who... Uh, may have been stopping somebody from uh, taking control, from, from communicating or from coming in or whoever this person is. Um, but now, with that Knight of Swords, there, this is like very fast movement, put it, movement, putting plans in action. Somebody is about to put their plans in action. 
um, they were restricted by another person. Now that person has been removed, has been removed from the situation and they can, you know, they can uh, follow through. So, uh, my my reading, what I have to say is that get prepared for some sort of arrival. It's a sudden arrival or it's a message or some sort of sudden communication. We have somebody here that is about to take control. This is a very wise individual who is very noble. Okay, this person is noble, but wants to do things right, wants to do things the right way, wants to do things with integrity. And I think that they had were restricted by another person that, you know, may have been trying to stop them, you know, stop them from going or stop them. It was like that wedge that was in the middle of the road, you know, that big boulder that couldn't be moved. Now this this obstacle is being removed. So now this person is able to follow through with their plans and they're and they're going to. This is somebody that is ready to fight. Um and, and, and you know, the fight is, is, is here because of that Six of Wands and the Knight of Swords. You know, get ready. There could be a, there could be a fight. There could be some sort of argument or there could be somebody fighting for, you know, the top position, you know. Um, but the very first card out is the Knight of Pentacles. That's hard work. That is somebody that is very... Uh, practical, you know, that wants to build the foundation and will do whatever it takes, will not give up, okay? So somebody is, is willing to do whatever it takes to build a foundation, you know? Um, I feel like whoever this person is, is in a, you know, position of status or something like that. This could be a business owner or a judge or a ruler or... You know, somebody that is, is in, you know, a very high position, I feel, as though this person has worked really, really hard and, and fought a lot of battles in their life. So there's a lot of life experience here. Um, now, now this person can follow their plans and they're going to. So um, If you've been been thinking that uh, there was another person that was in the way, you know, you were probably correct. Um, this person is being removed with that Eight of Swords reversed. Maybe they removed themselves. Maybe they left. I don't know. Anyhow, let's get one more card. <laughs> I do that a lot, huh? Knight of Knight of Swords. We have a very sharp, clever individual who is moving very, very quickly. They're moving very, very quickly towards something that they want. They are putting their plans into action. Knight of Cups. Oh my God! So this is definitely following, acting on feelings, following their heart, looking for love. Uh, communicating, expressing their feelings. Somebody is really, this is like a knight in shining armor of some sort, okay? This is a lover. This is a, definitely a lover that is taking action. They've been planning it and, you know, I feel as though, you know, this is great, okay? So get prepared. Get prepared for some sort of invite, offer, expression of love or something like that. Somebody's definitely going to be acting on their feelings. Forgiveness may be needed with the Knight of Cups. This could be an admirer. It could be a secret admirer. does end in victory though with that six of wands that's victory that is success anyhow i think an obstacle is being removed somebody's been hiding their feelings there may have been somebody that was 
stopping somebody from taking action. But I feel like that person is being removed from the equation somehow. Maybe they left or they're leaving or something like that. Anyhow, this is an arrival of some sort or communication. It's loving, kind, truthful. This is somebody that is very sensitive. It's also very well thought out. Well thought out, well planned. Very, uh, so whoever this person is responsible, wanting to do the right thing. Anyway, good luck.